All right. So uh, as a lot of you probably know, um, as much as I love Cadence Cold Beers and as much as she is one of my dearest friends, she is not into football, baseball, or anything of the like. What the hell? I know. I am clearly, clearly, I mean, look at me. Um, you get a night. Yes. Is that a nice six? So, oh yeah, number 96, Tom oh Johnson, goodness. Tom Johnson, Saints. Who that? Who that? Also a Texas fan, so, you know, this is just some of my everyday gear during the season. Uh, so, one of my other, other closest friends is here with me in the studio. Uh, how should I introduce you? What would you like to call yourself? Cajun Bob, Wool of Toast, baby. Cajun Bob, Wool of Toast. So, we are here to talk football with y'all, because it's football, y'all. All right. So, what first you think? First things first. How do we deal with Bill O'Brien? Oh, that was the biggest news, I think, in the entire NFL, is that they finally, the Texans finally got rid of Bill O'Brien, which they should have done ages ago. Uh, They've got a beautiful team. We were just talking uh, Deshaun Watson a few minutes ago. Just a wonderful quarterback. Um, I'm going to defer to to Bob here on the uh, the Texans. Yeah. Well, your bad situation is, that they didn't have a preseason, so that that was bad. However, however, they, Bill O'Brien did not figure out what was going on with the offense, and so suddenly through three games, constantly they roll, rolled against against the offensive tackle, uh, Mr. Tunsil. Yeah. Sorry, sorry, no, not Tunsil, Tyus Howard. The other side. Uh, Yeah. And they just broke him. They broke him, and he didn't have a choice. He had no choice. But uh, you can't fire a cow. Yeah. Unfortunately, yeah. Yeah, he's just an owner. Yeah. He's a bad owner. Unfortunately, like, uh, well, his dad, Bob McNair, was a racist owner. Yeah. Let's be honest with that. So Cal is just simply getting back and doing his thing, cashing the checks. Yeah. Now, who do you who would be okay in in the dream world? Who would be your ideal replacement for Bill O'Brien? Mm, wow, that that's that's a hard it's a hard placement. Uh, I, w- I would uh, I would say the. Uh, LSU head coach. Yeah, right. I'm right. Just kind of like sitting yeah. on that. I'll, he's, I, I, I think he's ready to make the there. jump. Yep. I really do. I think he's ready to make the jump. He is. Wow. Yeah. Talk about ready to make the jump to the big time. They are unstoppable. Yeah. And well, 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 he lost. He lost that game. He lost that game with uh, Mississippi State. Mm-hmm. And he owned it. Yeah. Which, which, which is really cool. Yeah. In fact, they owned it. It's, obviously, something's got to give. I mean, I, when you get to zero and four. Yeah. Zero and four. Zero and like, four is not a good look. It yeah, it's never a good, a good look. look. Uh, it's never a good look. I mean, you you know about Cleveland. You you, you know about. I mean, they're 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 running everybody across the board. Oh yeah. Oh, you yeah. see that? Did you see that? Uh, that uh, that game. This weekend against the Cowboys? Yes. Odell Beckham with the reverse? Yes. Crazy sexy. <laughs> and then, and then the 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 the, the field goal block. Cowboys floundered that. Yep. Two points for Cleveland. Yep. Can't, can't be mad at that. Why am I going into the fucking Sanford and something? I always, my brain always goes there. Um, Sanford, that is not Sanford Sun. Yeah. Sanford Sun is it? Yeah, that's what I say. I went to the. Oh, 
I need to knock it off on the wine. Anyway, um, I just called him Phil O'Brien. I don't know who Phil O'Brien is. If Phil you're out there, I'm very Phil sorry. I think Phil O'Brien. Yeah. Can I say it? What? Is that his like little kid that's in a wheelchair? Let's talk about the Saints. Ooh, so yeah. the Saints, the Saints had a rocky ass start. Now they, it was very satisfying in Week One to watch them brutalize Tom Baby. Uh, mm. I was delighted. Uh, uh, you know, I. I've been, uh, our, our Saints fans, we have a really solid crew that would get together every week and literally swing from rafters and shit like that. Now, we haven't been able to do it this season, so we've been MacGyvering all kinds of ways to sure. watch together on Zoom. We're on group me all talking shit to each other. Uh, it's, you know, it's pretty, because, you know, Saints fans are a special breed of crazy. So we, uh, we, we were delighted to all... Uh, you know, watch watch Tom Baby go down from our respective living rooms. But following two weeks really sucked. And we've got six major starters out right now. Uh, the fact that we squeaked by the Lions, sorry, Neil DeBerry, if you're watching this, <laughs> the fact that that was not just a straight up blowout is really disturbing. I'm hoping Michael Thomas comes back, but I want to give some credit to Emmanuel Sanders. That's the man. Oh, Emmanuel Sanders. God. Trust me, when when Breezes drops in, mm -hmm. he looks for him, even oh, yeah. in double coverage. Even in double coverage. Yeah, because Kamara, you can't put the whole game on Kamara. No, you, you can't. You know, bitching Kamara is wonderful. And, yes. Oh, I love set him. The run, set the run to build, build, the, build the path. Yeah. And but but Sanders Sanders literally makes makes up for Michael Thomas not being there. Oh yeah, he's poetry in fucking motion. He really is. And I love watching him. And I just, you know, Emmanuel Sanders, if you're watching, and even if you're not, I hope you will someday. I love you. Thank Ooh, you, that, man. Man. I saint. You Ooh, know what's up. Who are you know, be playing next week? Chargers. Mm, yeah. Los Angeles. Yeah. Playing the, the Chargers. Other Los Angeles. Right. They used to they used to be uh, you know, San Diego. Yeah. Good friend of mine is very, very upset about the fact that they're not San Diego anymore. And also, okay, can we talk about the Raiders for a second? Oh, Vegas. How many, how many damn times? Are they, I mean, I know, I know that game against the Saints. There were so many bullshit calls. That was a gimme because they're in a brand new city in their brand new stadium, and you know, uh, they call they call it the Death yeah. Star. Did you know the that? De yes, the Death Star. I'm like, do you, you realize what happened to yes. the Death Star? Right. You know where a good place to get COVID is? Casinos. <laughs> so yeah. Um, <laughs> Uh, All I'm saying is, hey, good luck to you, fucking what Raiders? Yeah, yeah. Oakland, Los Angeles, Las Vegas Raiders. Hopefully, a city will stick with you for more death than like star. five minutes. Yeah, good luck in your death What's star, y'all. What do you mean, think about the Packers? Those guys are trying to put it together. They really are. They really are. Um, I try not to fault Patrick for that being his uh, second favorite team. All right. But at least I, I made him a Saints fan, so I did my job. Um, yeah, yeah. You can't you can't you can't hate on you can't hate on Packers fan. I know. I mean, uh, Angie Stokes, Packers fan, big yeah, time. Absolutely. Yeah, and you know, was somebody I love like a sister. So, I mean, a lot of there are a lot of Packers fans out there that are uh, that are pretty awesome, and well, you know, it's really cold up there. I grew up around the Great Lakes. I know y'all ain't got nothing else. Other than that, up there. <laughs> so, you know, hey, from here on, go pack, go. I guess because uh, because well, yeah, you already I, whooped our asses. I'm this gonna, I'm gonna go on the back side of that. Oh yeah, Aaron Rodgers. Uh, he and uh, Danica Patrick oh, split yeah? the bed. Oh really? Yeah, Danica oh. Patrick's doing her own thing. Wow. And he's trying to trying to win another football round. Well, I know it sounds weird. There you it have is it. What it is. 
these athlete romances or well sports romances i guess uh they either work or they don't you yeah. know uh oh, yeah. by the way jj watt i hope i hope you and your lady are doing great and i'm sorry to all the sad women in houston and across america that, when i uh, say jj well there's there's multiple jj's i mean pittsburgh got two yeah Oh yeah, Steelers. Two, two multiple what? I do. I do have a. They, uh, they uh, broke. They broke the Houston Texans fucking. Nah, well, you know. Uh, nah, you know. Uh, go into that. Juju from the Steelers, right? Yeah, uh, Juju. Um, Juju Smith Suchu. Oh, yeah. Oh my goodness. I have a T-shirt with his name on the back that uh, my my oldest friend from uh, uh, Pittsburgh gave me uh, last year, a year before when we saw each other, and she's like, "I know you're a Saints fan, but." Just please wear this when you know when when we're not playing the Saints, and you know we do. We're we're Juju's very for real, man. Juju, he's for real. I Mr. know. Smith Juju, he, Juju, he is awesome. Juju great, is amazing. Great player. I proudly wear that t-shirt. Receiver. I proudly wear that t-shirt. For your fantasy people. Yeah, I was. That was check good, out. Good call. That check was out Mr. Question. Jefferson from uh, Minnesota Vikings. Hmm. You don't have him, pick him. Hmm. Man's a monster. Terrifying. He looks like, and I don't say this, I don't say this lightly, he looks like a new Andre Ryzen. Oh, wow. Yeah. Not not burning down houses with a TLC or not. Yeah, you know, yeah. But still, yeah. But yeah. as far as his play, man. I, his hands is he's pretty. He just gets after it. Nice, nice. Yeah. I'm gonna have to check him out. I miss fantasy football, man. I, I, I ever since I Ian to... stopped doing it, Ian. Um, I yeah, I haven't, I haven't gotten into a league uh, in like three years. I miss that shit. So. My my league, uh, my league did not go this year. Oh no. Yeah, I know, I know. Shit. Dubs League of Doom. Yeah, yeah. Twelve, twelve years in. He decided not to run. He decided not to run. And I accepted the fact because we didn't have a playoff. Yeah. Or sorry, preseason. We didn't have a preseason. So therefore, yeah. What's the point? Is suddenly some of the money starts to go sideways. Mm-hmm. And no, nobody wants sense. to deal yeah. with it. It looks like Cleveland's gonna gonna go make a run for it. <laughs> you know what? I'm all for that. I'm all for that. Cleveland, you know, they need their moment. Uh, they haven't had one in a while. Odell, you know? Beckham, Odell Beckham dropped a trial. Yeah, yeah. Baker Mayfield, apparently all those uh, all those uh, commercials he does, him just sitting there in the, in yep. the stands. Oh, yeah. Are they any good? I don't I, I mean, <laughs> I'm kind of sideways with it. Yep. Sorry, I got a whole bunch of bullshit under the desk, so I'm trying to like comfortably sit, and I'm like, it's like, Wah! there's this whole, yeah, you can't see it on camera, and that's the magic of uh, of being on camera is you don't see all the bullshit you're surrounded by. But if you notice, she still has pants. We're good. I do have pants. Hooray for pants. Um. Anyway, yep, yep. Pants are pants are good if you're going to be on camera. If you're not, terrible, terrible, terrible thing. What do you think about the the collapse of the uh, of Cam Newton and the with Patriots? COVID? See, I think this is going to keep happening. What cause... do you think about that? That that's the one thing we hadn't covered yet. Yeah, that and that's a very important one. Uh, I'm wondering how much this is going to fuck up the NFL this season because you know that's not going to be now. It's hit. It's hit. Uh, I think it hit the Chiefs too, right? It's, yes. It's hit yeah. at least three NFL teams. Drew Brees, if you're watching, and I hope you do someday, and it's gonna Please this is do. gonna get to you too late. Stop licking your fingers. That's yeah. how you get the Rona, dude. I'm constantly yelling that at the screen. Well, if he licks his own fingers, those don't lick anybody. I else's know, but he's still it. everybody's handling that ball, man. Oh, you know? No, 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 no. Every single time, every single time a ball comes out, it's Fritz. But the last guy. Whoever's handled on the other side better be is the, one, is the one that's that's throwing the ball out. All right, all ball. right. So, well, if that guy gets the roll, find your the handler. Fucked. Find yeah. your handler. That's what I'm saying. Uh, you know, put put a fucking implant a GPS in your handler. 
so yeah. that so that we know that you know breeze is getting a freshly pureled ball every time so when he licks his fucking fingers he just you know he just i don't know why he keeps doing that man just stop i know it's your thing but please just stop it is weird to see uh you know when you're hearing the people when they pipe in the sounds the crowd sounds oh man that's so weird. just I mean, in in the Saints, the first Saints game uh, against the Buccaneers, it was funny because they even have the crowd booing for the BS ref calls, and I'm like, okay, that's that's actually hilarious. Other than that, it's kind of surreal. So, um, well, you know, I was I was doing a I was doing the uh, rock or doing the playoffs mm-hmm. with the with the NBA, and they had this whole thing where you could literally like push a button. And constantly in, encourage the sound inside of the uh, in, inside of the city. Yeah. Now that's that's not the same thing. You know? Yeah. It was it was fun. It was it was absurd. It, it felt like a video game to me, which it was. Yeah. Like I'm, I'm, I'm sitting. I'm literally just sitting there pushing the button non non stop non right? stop non stop. <laughs> Come on, Rockets! Come yeah, on, I used to root yeah. for him and just going. But you know, eventually, LA just. Well, there's there's more LA fans than there are Rockets fans, so that's what it is. Yeah. This has been Foosball Talk with Foosball Cajun Talk. Bob and Amanda Wolf. Uh, go they Saints! Rip. Go Texans and go Astros! Astros.